Hello everyone, welcome to Food Splendor. I'm Austin and today I'm going to show you how to make the best pancakes in the world. Now to make the best pancakes, you do not need any extra ingredients except for the right pancake ingredients, which include, for this recipe, we'll use one and a half cup of self-rising flour or one and a half cup of all-purpose flour with two and a half teaspoon of baking powder and three eggs half cup of milk, quarter cup of sugar, two teaspoons cinnamon, one teaspoon nutmeg, two teaspoons of vanilla, and one teaspoon of salt. Now to show you how easy this recipe is, all you need to do is whisk the eggs together until they are foamy or looking a little bit bubbly, and then add your milk and vanilla to that. That's your liquid ingredients. After that, you're going to combine all your dry ingredients and then mix both liquid and dry ingredients together and you have your pancake recipe ready to be fried. Now there are two ways to do your pancakes. You can do them with oil or without oil and I'm going to show you both methods and you'll see the texture of how they turn out and you'll choose which one you'll want to do. So you can use a non-stick frying pan for your for your pancake if you do not want to use oil. If you do use oil, there is a particular way that you may want to do it and then you choose. Of course, depending on the method that you choose, the one with oil or butter may turn out with a little more flavor because of the fat that is added. However, it will look, look significantly different and it will taste slightly different and be a little bit more moist. So it's all up to you which one you'll choose. Now I also want you to know that it's not really possible for you to spoil a pancake. Uh, if you over mix it, it may taste a little bit firmer than normal because the gluten in the flour would develop. But if all the ingredients are in the right proportion, like this recipe is, all you need to do is mix them up together and just throw them in your frying pan and you are good to go. Now this recipe has the eggs and the milk that will add richness and tenderness. It also has sugar which will add the sweetness. The cinnamon, nutmeg and vanilla will add the flavor in terms of the spiciness and then the salt will bring out a pop of all of the flavors combined. And that's where you have the perfect and best pancake in the world. Okay, so your pancake will look like this. It is done without oil. It will have a more even tone on the outside because most of the butter was touching the frying pan. On the other hand, when you use oil, you will, it will look like this because the oil puddles are causing uneven tones because the area that looks uh, slightly white are the areas that did not touch the frying pan so you have different tones throughout the texture of your pancake all right everyone thank you so much for watching i truly hope this video was of some help if it was please let me know in the comments or give me a thumbs up and if you do like my videos consider subscribing 
and ring that notification bell so you do not miss my next upload thank you for your time and see you next time